Hey everyone, it's me and the Game Nerds here bringing you my review of Kill a Kill Episode 3. Now overall I thought this episode of Kill a Kill, it was definitely an improvement over Episode 2. Now in case you haven't seen my Episode 2 review, I thought it was good, but a bit flawed on how, to me it felt like, it felt like it was a, the series was going to end up being formulaic because halfway through the second episode I felt like it was more so repeating what happened in the first one. And that did get kind of on my nerves because I'm like, oh, it's just gonna be more so the same shit repeating over and over again. But no, this episode actually felt this episode didn't didn't more so repeat anything. Thing felt felt like now then what more so happened in this episode? We we learn about some these things known as life fiber, which life fiber these are what Goku suits are made of. Like I believe the one percent Goku suits, like well not more so made of more for fiber that is in the Goku suit, like we find out like 1 star Goku suits have got 10% fiber, life fiber, which, shit I forgot to explain what life fiber is, it's more so like, it's what gives the Goku suits their strengths, and like a 5 star Goku suit, I mean a 3 star one, has got like 50%, is made out of 50% life fiber, and there's, and then there are, but there are Goku suits that are made out of 100% life fiber, and these are, I believe they're called, they're pronounced Kamiu, Kamiai, or however you pronounce them. And we even see in this episode the fact that, that one of the clubs is more so trying to create a Kami suit. And we even find out that Sing Singitsu Ryoku suit is a life fiber, which, and that the, and as we even get a reason on why, the, why Ryoko's father was killed. It's due to the fact that it's possibly linked due to how how more so the fact that he that him he was the only person outside of Sakisuke, that president's clan that knew about the Goku suits that may have entirely out of life fiber. And all right, I have a feeling like if a Goku suit's made off entirely of life fiber, it's going it's more so life. Because we see in this episode, Sa Saikiski, she ha actually, her family has one of these Kami suits. And that, it it looks like it, it's just like with Singetsu, which is, which that suit's name is Jungetsu. On how these, on how the fact that Morse has a conscious, it's alive, and can pro possibly talk like, in one part in the first, in the beginning of the episode, we see its eye open during a flashback scene of when Saki Sakatsuki, where she actually gets it for the first time when she's a, a little girl. So it's most likely just like with Ryoku suit a lot with life, just like Sing Singetsu. That is probably it. that I would not be surprised if that's the case. And what else was there? Oh yeah, is the fact that that we see like I believe this was triggered by another more so switch on Ryoko's glove that more so gave the suit a power boost and for a bit it made her look like she was on par with Sakatsuki. I believe that that is how a more so worked. And what else was there? But she looks. She it looks like she still is not strong enough. Because if that fight went on for a little bit longer, it would have been obvious that that Ryoko would have lost big time. She would have. And oh yeah, like the action in this episode is it is the action. This one's definitely the best yet. Like the part where they more so enter that hallway school, and when they're fine, fine, we see it's like I believe it was one of those moments to where it slows. To where they're more so fine, fine, like when they're chasing each other, like or about approach each other for attack, it speeds up. But when they hit the attack, it slows down. But when they go for the attack, it slows down just for a bit. When they attack, and that I love scenes like those. I thought that action scene was great, and some of the work of CG in this episode was actually I would say pretty good. The overall kill a kill episode three is. In my opinion, the best episode so far of Kill a Kill. What did you guys think of this episode? Did you love it? Did you hate it? Give me your thoughts down below in the comments. 
But yeah, anyways, if you like this video, leave a like. If you dislike it, leave a dislike. Something me if you want to see more content like this. But yeah, anyways, I'm Anime Demon Nerd signing out. Peace.